Kuya and good morning, morning Mark Sambai. I'm Ron. And I'm Julius. Welcome to Food Trip. For today's food trip, we will take you on an epic culinary adventure around the street of San Francisco. Now, when people think of San Francisco, they think of one thing and one thing only, the Golden Gate Bridge, right? But people don't talk about the food that make this city famous. San Franciscans have always had a certain taste, meaning culinary creators are always upping their game. And of course, one way to discover San Francisco delicacies is to do so with your friends. Kaya mga kasambahay, isasama namin kayo for today's food trip. Kaya, samahan niyo kami. Stop today is Chapino here at Fog Harbor. Ano ba ang Chapino? In short, it's a seafood stew here in San Francisco that is originated in the late 19th century and is a popular dish at many seafood restaurants such as the Fog Harbor. Now, the origins of this dish come from Italian immigrants who would work as fishermen in the city's bustling ports. And then they would use their catch of the day, which would be fish, calamari, clams, mussels, and Dungeness mm. crabs, and turn it into a rich, beautiful tomato stew made with white wine, herbs, wow. and garlic. Right? Oh, that's tasty. Th that sounds good, right? That sounds you want, good. Let, let's try, let's try let's some right now. Came at the, at, at the Nasha, guys. This is Chapino. Chapino. It's Chapino. Chapino. It's, Itali it's Italiano. Okay. <laughs> this looks good. So it's got the young shrimp. Shrimp. I'm assuming this is some sort of white fish. And you also have bits of Dungeness crab in here as well. At the, we have the mussels. Yeah. Clams at the, at the Sha right here. Mm. Clams. And then you have obviously the, the bits of tomato, tomato sauce. Looks so delicious, looks so appetizing, can't wait to tuck in. With the sourdough garlic bread. And, and, and then you also have the sourdough garlic bread from Sao Sao. Yes. Right? That looks appetizing. Alright guys, bon appetit. Make cheers more now. Okay. Two, two, three. Bon cheers. appetit. Cheers guys. Get some fish and the tomato sauce. Yeah. That's a beautiful seafood stew. Mm. Let's taste, let's taste the bit of shrimp. I'm gonna try the the clam. clam. Ooh, it's very good. Mm. That's delightful. Uh, uh. Mamma mia, you need you don't even need to go to Italy for some authentic Italian food. This is it right here in San Francisco. Mm -hmm. Right? This is what makes San Francisco, San Francisco. Something as humble as a seafood stew turned elevated into a rich, delectable dish. Have a bite, guys. Mm. That, no? That's so good. Yum. a second location for today, Boudin. Now, this place was established in 1849 and is an SF icon wow. known for its sourdough bread. This place is unique dahil nagsimula ito sa isang mother bread maker 170 Ooh. years ago. At ang sourdough bread niya ay naging symbol ng isang culinary heritage here in San Francisco. Now, the way to go is this. You have to order a clam chowder Ooh. in a sourdough Sour bread, bread bowl. Oh, I can't wait for this. Let's I've been dying for this. Taste. How about we have a taste? Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, are you excited? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Okay. Look, look at this. Taste. Th th this looks so Everyone? good. This is like the only reason why I come to San Francisco. It's still hot. All right. Yeah, that's good. That's good. That's How about we try the famous sourdough so, bread? So basically, the way to go, ma, grab some bahai, some bahai, break it off, and then sao sao. Make sao sao. So not then. And there's that perfect contrast between in terms of texture and flavor as well. Yep. The saltiness of the clam chowder with the with, with the, the sweetness seafood. of the bread and the seaweed of the bread. It just it's like a 
medley of flavor, basically. It's mixed with the seafood inside the soup. So the soup also has bits of clams, potatoes, oh, I think parsley, or no, parsley, yeah. But the only reason why I would come to San Francisco, like I say, you can't get this anywhere it's else. famous for, huh? Yeah, exactly, the bar. That's, what's, that's what addicting. makes it so good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, every time, perfect. And finally, for dessert. You know, I'm craving something sweet. Welcome to Ghirardelli Square, home of the original Ghirardelli Chocolate Company, which is now transformed into a foodie haven. Alam niyo ba mga kasambay, this place was one of the first in the U.S. to be creatively repurposed. Instead of demolishing the old factory, they transformed it into a vibrant square we see today, preserving its history while giving its new life. But we all know why we're here, right? It's the dessert. Yes. We're going to be trying San Francisco's best hidden secret, the world famous hot fudge sundae from Ghirardelli. Yes. Tara, let's get some ice cream. Cheers. Cheers. Oh wow, this is so, so good. So, it's got, cream. it's got your vanilla ice cream, it's got your whipped cream, it's got your cherry, your top fudge sundae. And then, in true Ghirardelli fashion, it's also got the Ghirardelli um, chocolate. chocolate square. Let's get some taste. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's really good. I like that. If you're sweet too there, this is best for you. This, this, is, this is honestly better than anything you can get around here in San Francisco. Take another bite. Mm -hmm. mm, yeah. Mm. I want to I have another bite just for the, the hot fudge. Ooh. Ooh. You got caramel in, inside it too. I'll, I'll, I'll actually do like this particular one because I do like caramel inside the chocolate. And that's it's what like, like a different color of the ice cream, huh? Yeah, it has a nice. It, it, it balances from the sweet from the from the ice cream too. Mm -hmm. And that's it for today's food trip. I hope you satisfy your cravings by taking you to places that make San Francisco San Francisco. We're, We're your hosts. hosts. I'm Ron, and I'm Julius, and, and this, this is food trip. trip.